at the foot of a mountain the elevation of its summit is 45 degree after ascending 1000 meters towards the mountain up a slope of 30 degree inclination the elevation is found to be 60 degree find the height of the mountain so what is given here so let the height of the mountain be h and let this be the slope of the mountain right this is the steep climb okay or the elevation of the mountain and what are they saying at the foot of the mountain the elevation of its summit is 45 degree so see this is one side of the mountain right the other side will be like this right so this is the mountain that we are referring to so this angle is given as 45 degrees and what is happening somebody is ascending 1000 meters towards the mountain up a slope of 30 degree inclination so basically somebody is trying to climb this mountain at a slope of 30 degrees inclination so the person is climbing at a slope of 30 degrees so he is moving like this this angle right is let me just write this 45 outside so that it's clear so this angle is 45 degree okay so somebody is climbing up this mountain with an inclination of 30 degrees so he is climbing the mountain like this and he is traveling a distance of 1000 meters now at that point right he is stopping here at this point the elevation is found to be 60 degree so at this point what is the angle of elevation the angle of elevation is 60 degree now what are they asking what is the height of the mountain so this is the figure that you have now let us just give these points some names let this be o e a d b and c now if you consider triangle oce that is oce this triangle right this is 90 degree so what can i say i can say what is sin 30 sin 30 is equal to ce by oc or ce by 1000 right see oc is 1000 this length is 1000 so sin 30 is sin 30 is ce by 1000 or this is equal to 1 by 2 or what can i say what is the value of ce ce is equal to 1000 by 2 or 500 so ce is 500 similarly if i find out what is cos 30 in the same triangle in the same triangle i can say cos 30 is equal to oe by oc that is 1000 right oe by 1000 or i can say what is oe oe that is equal to 500 root 3 because cos 30 is root 3 by 2 if you substitute that you get oe is equal to 500 root 3 now now let us consider the triangle aob so if you consider this triangle aob then what can you say you can what is tan 45 tan 45 that is equal to ab by oa correct and we know tan 45 is equal to 1 or what can you say you can say that ab that is equal to oa and what is cd here see if you look at this rectangle here i can say cd is equal to ea correct cd that is equal to ea or this is equal to oa minus oe right what is ea ea in terms of oa and oe is ea is equal to oa minus oe or again what is oa see i have already found out that oa is equal to ab and both of these is equal to h or i can say cd is equal to h minus oe now i have already found out that oe is equal to 500 root 3 or what can i say i can say cd is equal to h minus 500 root 3 similarly what is the length bd in terms of h see bd is equal to ab minus ad or this is equal to ab minus ce that is equal to h minus 500 basically i am trying to represent everything in terms of h so that i'll be able to solve for h now we have got these now consider the triangle bcd so if you consider triangle bcd what is tan 60 tan 60 is equal to bd by cd or that is root 3 is equal to what is bd see i have found bd in terms of h i have also found cd in terms of h so bd is equal bd is what bd is h minus 500 so you get root 3 is equal to h minus 500 by h minus 500 root 3 so solve for this what will you get you will get 
root 3 h minus 1500 that is equal to h minus 500 or uh, you can say h into root 3 minus 1 that is equal to 1000 or h is equal to 1000 by root 3 minus 1 or h is equal to 1000 into root 3 plus 1 by 3 minus 1. Yeah, I am just taking the conjugate and multiplying or I get this is nothing but 5000 by um, see root 3 plus 1 by 2 into 1000 right meters you get but what are they asking they are asking here in terms of kilometers. So, this is in terms of meters so this is nothing but root 3 plus 1 by 2 kilometers. Yes, see till now we have found the answer in terms of meters in the options they have given in terms of kilometers. So, these many meters is nothing but divided by 1000 kilometers. So, what is your answer root 3 plus 1 by 2 kilometers. I hope it is clear we considered the triangles right we considered the three triangles one was this triangle OCE and AOB and BCD. So, using these three triangles we found out the value of the height of the mountain. So, your answer is root 3 plus 1 by 2 kilometers option 1. A man standing in one corner of a square football field observed that the angle subtended by a pole in the corner just diagonally opposite to this diagonally opposite corner is 60 degree. When he retires 80 meters from the corner along the same straight line he finds the angle to be 30 degree the side of the field is dash. So, basically what is happening the man is standing in this corner and there is a pole here ok this is the pole. So, the angle subtended by the pole to this corner this angle is given as 60 degree yes it is 60 they have accidentally put a 1 there it is 60 degree here yeah let me just uh, write it correctly this is 60 degree ok this is 60 and when the man retires 80 meters from this corner that is basically is going back like this when he goes back 80 meters this angle with the end of the pole now that becomes 30 degree you have to find the side of the field. So, to do that let us first find out this length which is the diagonal of the field once you get the diagonal it is easy for us to find the side ok. So, now first consider the triangle ABC. So, if you look at triangle ABC what can you say you can say tan 60 yes that is equal to x by i or this is equal to root 3 or I can say x is equal to i root 3. Similarly, now consider the triangle ABD using this triangle you can say tan 30 which is equal to 1 by root 3 that is equal to x divided by i plus 80 right. So, here I already got see what should I find out I have to find out the value of i and I already know x is equal to i root 3 I substitute that here what will I get. So, 1 by root 3 is equal to i root 3 divided by i plus 80 or I can say 2 i is equal to 80 or i is equal to 40. So, if i is equal to 40 what is the side see what is the diagonal actually the diagonal is nothing but side into root 2 the side is a that a into root 2 is 40. So, what is a? a is equal to 40 by root 2 which is equal to 20 root 2 meters. So, what is the side of the square square field the side of the field or the side of the square is 20 root 2 meters that is option 4.